We are here. What is this? Grand finales. Grand finales. Dill, Jen, here we go. This is the regular matchup. Just going to monkey flip. Why not? Just do it. Who, who put uh, Jen in losers? Uh, Ralphie. With Cloud. Yeah? Yeah. So why did he? Okay. Whatever. Anyway, uh, still taking advantage of Ryu's bad run speed. Yeah. Uh, just getting out of there. Yeah, you can kind of just run after, run away from Ryu, man. Hit him and just run away. I mean, that might not be the case in Ultimate because Ken is uh, <laughs> faster than Ryu. <laughs> but he still looks kind of slow. Doesn't look like he's like tremendously faster. Yeah. But nonetheless, we got Ryu on the stage right now. Down to it. Not gonna do it. Not yet. Okay, good trade. Why that move trades with everything? The world will never know. What? I guess it's her box. Push it off. I don't know. Pushed off the banana? Didn't even activate it? Just pushed it? Okay. Oh, but that's gonna be it. Yeah. Uh, Down to a forward smash. Still always like celebrating stocks with like the barrels. Just, yeah. I don't know. Hooray. One day he's just gonna barrel right off the stage by accident. Speaking of barrels. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Nasta freaking Damas. Literally barrels right off the stage, but gets spiked for it. Okay, here we go. Jen letting Dill pull his banana. Doesn't want to get hit by any like stuff. Hey, nice. Dill coming out of the shield. A little bit too slow. It's pretty tough to punish that nair. If you get hit um, with that nair lower on your shield, it's pretty. It's really tough to uh, punish it. With uh, Ryu's there. Oh, yeah, Ryu's there. Definitely. Yeah. If he lands on your shield with that and he hits you low, it's a nightmare. I do believe that has, like, the least landing lag of any other two game. Yeah? Yeah, besides Mega Man's there. But that one's live, so it doesn't really count. Yeah. Here we go. Are you going to let him back on stage for free? I think he's just lift, run to the other side of the stage. Uh, not gonna put on any pressure. Bold grabs I think. Oh, this time, okay. Try and put himself in position to like do something about the monkey flip, but realizing, okay, probably not worth it. Oh. Okay. Now you're in this situation again. Yeah. Okay, use the focus. Ooh, gonna get the spark. Nonetheless. Uh, Dill understanding where they, where he's gonna win this matchup. If he wants to kill him on the stage, he's gonna. Oh, excuse me. I thought the percentages were switched. Dill opted <laughs> just try not to die right now. Actually, he's already put on enough uh, enough percentage. Right now, he just doesn't want to do something unsafe like monkey flip into the kick right into him. I don't even know if that would have uh, auto canceled. That was a good show you though. A little bit late, but. I get it. <laughs> the fact that he rolled late saved him because he knew the roll was coming. Oh, okay. Smart by Dill. Monkey flipping the other way, but no, it doesn't matter anymore. Jen taking first yeah. game. Nice job by Jen. Uh, Dill took an early lead and he walked him down. His focus. I like it. And the thing is, Dill understands that that can happen. So that's why even though he was up about 80%, 70%, he was up frozen. Uh, even though he was up by a good amount of percent, he still uh, he still understood that, listen, I can die. This is Ryu, man. You can die at any time. If you don't know that, it's 2018. There's only 23 days left until this game is dead and gone. If you don't know that by now, don't know that. I don't know what you're doing in Ultimate. Yeah. <laughs> okay, he's probably not. Oh my gosh. The, listen, just calling him out, bro. Literally Whoa. just said stop monkey flipping. <laughs> Chill, Jen. Oh my gosh. Oh. And he's. Okay, so he's definitely like inputting the short ones just in case he misses. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Call out. And it's not easy to do that, man. It's so easy to hold that button just long enough to get the long, I assure you. So you can tell Jen really understands this character. Uh, okay.
Okay. It looks like it looks like he smashed DI down so he can fall out a little bit earlier. Which is smart. Trade. Okay, there we go. Yeah, not having a lot of momentum right now. He's not uh you don't see him running into a lot of Dill's options. He's kind of keeping his feet grounded, walking him down. Ooh, yeah. that was scary for Dill. Ooh, there it is from by Jen. Mm -hmm. Oh, the trade. And now this this is why. This is why Jen is keeping his feet on the ground so often, so he can react to the monkey flips and the bad options by Dill. Just like that, he's able to trade with that uh, up smash. I'll take it. Drop it just like that. It's so crazy, man. Dill knows exactly when you're going to come out of shield. Like, we've seen him do that all day long. Kind of I didn't know that would be his out. Hard jab on him. You didn't know what? The hard jab beats out one people. Oh, yeah, that hard jab uh, hitbox is huge, man. Definitely good tool for like, that situation. Mm -hmm. And it's quick enough to, to be able to react to it. It's not, it's not like you have to do like a forward tilt or up tilt or something. It's literally just holding the A button. Okay. Yeah. Jen definitely like running it on him a lot more than he was previously. So. It looks like Jen is, Jen is doing a good job of staying right in the burst range. Um, not too close, not too far. So right. as soon as he does something unsafe, he's able to get there. Right, not letting him pull banana. Mm -hmm. Forcing him to like only be able to pull it when he gets the damage. Okay. Alright, what are we gonna do here? Jen opting to just stay neutral, not doing anything unsafe, waiting for that roll. Gonna punish it, not gonna get a sure you out of it though. But in that, he gave up stage control. Has to find his way down. Ooh, very ambitious fireball. Yeah. Okay. Jen doing a good job of just staying in between him and Banana. Every time uh, Dill pulls Banana, uh, Jen is there to contest it. Even though he may not grab it immediately, he's there to contest it. I do like that use of fireball. Because like, it did cancel with the Banana. It's actually something we've been seeing a lot like today. Uh -huh. Other people using projectiles to cancel out the banana and not have to like deal with that. Mm -hmm. Definitely a good tool to have. Really good. Ooh, there you go. Up smash. Gonna do it. Gonna do it. Great job by by Dill. Stay focused at the end of that match. Although Jen, you can see the momentum was in Jen's favor. He was in the middle of the stage. He had stage control a lot of that match, mm -hmm. but Dill didn't get tilted at all. He, he waited and waited. He was patient. Although he took some damage, he still waited and uh, was able to uh, close out the stock. Oh, go into Lilat. Lilat. People seem to be taking uh, Dill here a lot today. Mm -hmm. Ralphie did the same. Yeah. Uh, I mean, you definitely want to mess up. Uh, you can mess up Diddy's auto cancel shenanigans and his bananas and all that just kind of mix up the stage for him make it not as consistent something that you want to do only thing bad is up i believe up smash still hits the platforms by diddy so that's still scary but um also in this matchup uh oh, bro that was 30 seconds yeah. 30 seconds stock yeah. I'm definitely showing you know it was like all the intricacies in this matchup mm -hmm. uh, before he did it again, he did the hard jab on the monkey flip, I guess showing that that wasn't an accident before he is doing that, um, aware that it works. Yeah. Nice air dodge. Uh, and we go. We have great nair. Under a minute. We got to reset. Nice. Yeah, that was a really good nair. I like it. I like it a lot. Got the stock. Nothing to like lose going forward. Exactly. Forward. He had all the momentum, so even if he SD'd, he knew that he SD'd going for broke. And he, I mean, he had a lot of money. He was playing with house money with that one. <laughs> Upper stock, I'll take it. That was really smart by Jen. It's the, it's at the, this level of gameplay that you see like quick reactions, quick decisions being made. Um, on a lower level, you'll see uh, players kind of stay on stage, keep stage control, which isn't bad. It's not bad to keep stage control and keep uh, Diddy off the stage, but he saw an opportunity to get the kill very fast, 
and he capitalized on it. Here you go, some trades. Oh my goodness, man. These anti airs are too good. I wonder if his hitboxes are that good in Ultimate. I don't know. I haven't been following the reads, yeah. but not too much of the gameplay. Nonetheless, they're really good in this game. So, <laughs> look at that. Every time Dill pulls banana, it's always being, uh, it's always landing either right on top of Jen or behind Jen. So, uh, Dill has to go through Jen in order to um, retrieve it. Okay, balloon just gonna get rid of banana there. Jen trying to jump in with these nares a lot right now until not falling for it. Yeah, he's stuffing them out really well. That was really good. The invincibility on Shoryu would have pulled right through the banana. Right. And then Diddy's love to go trace the banana or trail the banana. So he would have got caught with the extended hitbox. Okay, how are we going to get down? Oh. Yeah, down tilt fair. Good job. Good. Um, he kind of exhausted a lot of his options uh, using his jump to do that focus attack. So, a scary situation for him. And look at those reactions. He, a lot of times you'll see Ryu's kind of throw out two or three um, tilts too many. Oh, and just going to combo break that. No rage, though, so it's not going to kill. Let's see if I can finish my thought. These guys are uh, not in the neutral. Oh, yeah. If he doesn't yeah. succeed the first time, Good do it again. Sure. Yeah, definitely. That's another one. <laughs> 2018, double show you by Ryu. That one's a little harder to get used to, though. Because, like, it's such a bad option that it's a good one. Okay, so we're back to even stock count. and Yeah, and the percentages don't even matter. <laughs> I mean, not yet yeah. as much. Well, you definitely don't want to be down, but seeing like how well Jen deals with Diddy's tools, um, uh -huh. she'll definitely be able to like get an opening probably soonish. Yeah, but that's the thing. Like, just as much as the high percent is means uh, reuse closer to dying, the fact that he he can kill you easier is just as scary, man. Okay, good job by him. He's throwing out those fireballs so he doesn't have to shield the peanuts. And then he could just trace the fireball. It's definitely like some of the smartest use of uh, Ryu's fireballs I've seen. Not a move to use that often aside from sometimes the red one. Yeah. We're we'll kind of trying to throw a hitbox off the stage. Wait, turn around and grab. Good job. 23. Both players just spacing their bears. Okay. Oh, you see, yeah, I'm gonna kill. And you see by uh by Dill, he um he grabbed them on top of the banana, but the banana didn't uh, the hitbox didn't activate. So he pummeled him a little bit, let the banana slide in, and even though it didn't break the grab, he still took the damage when the uh, banana hit him. So that might have put him right in range to die. Yeah, that looked really good, smart. Where's the gen take? Okay, back to Lila. That that definitely worked last set very well. So he's gonna be trying to get like repeat of some of that. Good plays. Definitely. Oh, you yeah. see Jen, he he's, he seems very comfortable on this stage, like very comfortable. Part of it might be um when Diddy does pull banana, then there's a good chance he'll fall on a platform. And then, yeah. Uh, he then like has to cut like because the platform's there. It kind of changes up like um, what you can do about it when he tries to pick it up. I agree. Usually Diddy's allowed to like plug banana in the land right like on the stage so he doesn't really have to place it. But now that it's kind of being placed on top of a platform, he, kind of, he has to go get it again. So I definitely agree. That plays a big part in this, um, this matchup on this stage. Right now, Jen just catching his feet, trying to get back on stage. Ooh. Good ledge option. It looks like the banana disappears when uh, Jen does focus attack with banana in hand. Just notice that. Just oh. do it. He absolutely could have died for that. But he kind of rocked him to sleep with his uh, 
which is walk forward, and then just went up and did it. Kind of like a fox main. <laughs> it's the worst thing in the world when a fox main uh, just runs up to you and up smashes because <laughs> oh, you're yeah. worn in shield. <laughs> so disrespectful. Okay. Very hey, good was, jumping on uh, Yeah. Calling out to his banana throw. Such a dangerous situation for uh, the game. Gonna trade with that uh that fair. That's not a good trade for Jim. He'll take the damage, but every time he's off stage he could die. Taking that banana right there was Did he oh jump? Gosh. Oh yeah. It looked like he caught his jump. That was bad. Jim definitely has a very good feel for like when Dill is not going to like be running in. Uh -huh. Every time he's like, you know, Dill's not doing that, Jen's fireballing, which is like, it's not safe because Dill could definitely like, you know, jump over the monkey flip or something. But since, oh, okay, wow, he made that. Um, but since Jen is aware of like when Dill isn't going to go in, then that fireball is a very good option to just delete projectiles. Yeah, definitely. And it also looks like he's reacting to the pop gun. Every, anytime he sees pop gun, he immediately just throws out the fireball. Okay, good call out. Oh, he DI'd in. Good job by Dill. Because he was getting carried off to uh, there. Absolutely. That trade with the banana on the up tilt put Dill right back in advantage. Dill's banana place is also very good like, over there. Um, plucking it in a way that it would help hit focus if he like focused. And then if he didn't focus, just land on the platform. Now you have to deal with that. Uh, right now, pretty, really even. Yeah. Definitely, this could go anybody's way. Um, seems like Dill is a little bit more scared, rightfully so. But um, this is on anybody's favor. Up throw, back air. Okay, you're not going to see any combo breaks now uh, because uh, any whiff by Jen could mean a uh, mean a stock. And he's on tournament stock right now. Let's see. Dill opting to get a fresh banana. Okay, he's going to trade with that uh, jab, I think it was. I think it was hard up tilt. Okay. Jen knowing that he's one banana interaction away from dying. Yeah. That's is very scary. Okay. Dill needs, to, Dill needs to pluck another banana. Yeah, that's definitely wasn't a good place to lose the interaction. Now he gets a banana. And you have to play very well here. Okay. Yeah. And it's kind of rinse repeat. He, uh, Jen kind of had to play around the banana. And I then. Yeah, me too. Uh, yeah. Ah, there it is. Man. The wet noodle smack. Yeah. <laughs> by, uh, by Dill. Good job by Dill. Good job. He played that very well. He understood exactly what he needed to do. Uh, Jen had the read on that roll, I just noticed. But uh, the fact that Dill um, slowed down the roll, um, kind of delayed it, kind of threw Jen off. So he put him in shield and made that roll safe. Yeah.